Hey, bubbling, coming in, crushing this art. Hey, 27, 27, 27th birthday, 27 day, 27 things. Here to talk about 27. So, if we break it down, 27, we start to understand by the digital root is 9. Thus, uh, the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, it finds itself in this higher mutable realm. Um, yeah, also being 9 of 7, 8, 9, it is the third. So 27 is doubly mutable and finds itself to be one of the 9s um, of the 36, being the four elemental expressions, which we can find more um, just by adding 9 to 36. So what? The next fire would be 40, 45, yeah. But either way, so 9 is fire, 27 is air, 36 is earth, and 18 is water. So, yeah. So if we start to talk about a little bit, a little bit about what this would mean, um, being in the realm of mutability is very volatile and changeable, um, just like cardinality. Whereas if we're thinking about fixity, fixity will be more steady and already agreed upon. Um, a good way to look at this or think about this is mutability is like being over at a friend's house and you're completely like subjected to their rules or going into other people's abodes, right? Um, where the ownership isn't public or more objective. Uh, when we think about fixity, we'll start to see more objectivity. Everybody's here. It's more a public place. Um, and it's more stable, right? Whereas cardinality is more selfish and it's more my place and it's more able to be volatile because it's just like the mind, right? The dreams, there's uh, a limitlessness to it, a limit, a limitlessness to it. So yeah, basically coming at this from a mutable place, it's always trying to give itself like and kind of be of service, right? Um, and being in the mutable realm, it always finds itself again um, in another in another's lane um and it digs that it's not like in another's lane trying to create its own and trying to show its own right getting sucked up and like learning lessons and learning how it can like express its itself it's really just trying to aid um in the general flow and then being air air is very similar in that it wants to aid in the general flow but it really wants to personally identify with what it's doing so air will be more likely to kind of slip out of a situation if it doesn't agree with it versus fire to maybe uh, bring it up but it still wants to be in a part of a situation that it agrees with uh, having that yang active component and so it's um it's yeah it still wants to be of itself it just wants to be able to do that more beta or more of a current so yeah so when we're thinking about 27 then being air in the mutable realm it's like it's getting sucked up and it's trying to find a place within that to express itself right and yeah it really is okay if that is of um, other right and in not being so steady it's not so refinement it may want to keep things keep things changing you know even though it wants to be of service and be help here maybe it doesn't want to be of help here, here forever right especially being air mut mutable and all these things all these things are very changeable right yeah so if we get a little more into 27 um 27 is 9 times 3, right? Um, and it's also, I don't think it's divisible by 4 or 5 or 2 or 6, no, 7, no, 8, no. Yeah, so it's just 9 and 3. Um, and that that is fire and air as well. And it being an air sign, it has this ability to move one by air. Looking at it, this bottom chart is where I show the multiple kidiv elements. Oh, and it being 27, why I put that star there, it's 3 times 3, right? Or 3 squared. Um, so 3 times 3 times 3, yeah. Um, so when we break that down, that fire by air, is this an ability to really see yourself in your expression, right? So this is really cool in that 27 is getting sucked up into a lot, but it really has an ability to utilize reason for thyself, right? And bring its personal alignment into it like care right not be doing it for you know the team doing it for the team because it cares about the team so yeah maybe doing it for the team but you know um but yeah but it also being a triple air it has this sort of ability um to utilize expression or knowledge too this sort of um 
Yeah, this sort of square there, right? To where 27 has this... Um, yeah, there's sort of sharpness in this connection to uh, reason towards logic, towards mind, right? Yeah. So, a little bit more about how it would express itself. It expresses itself 2 and 7, right? So 7 is mutable, um, or it's cardinal in the mutable realm, and 2 is fixed in the cardinal realm. So basically, 7 in the first place means that you're still trying to create, right, personally. It's still a cardinal sign. But you're still trying to create in like of service, right? In the mutable realm. Um, so yeah, that's a little bit about seven, how it's still trying to do its own thing, but through uh, other, through mutability, right? So that kind of kind of doubles down on its nature. And two in the second is just kind of like a fixity, like having the two being the personal or cardinal fixity is your personal structures, habits, reasons, right? Foundations. And so you just have an alignment with your personal habits, structures, reasons being just that, your own uh, structures and habits. So it's kind of like Taurian and um, steady, right? Two in the second. So yeah, a little bit about more 27. Um, yeah. So it's almost like with that steadiness, it's almost learning and picking up traits on how it's doing this and going about, still being of service, getting sucked up, but learning a lot of things, right? Learning an expressive role and taking an active role right uh, the air and whatever it's getting sucked up into um yeah so that's really cool a little bit um anything to sum up oh yeah it finds itself in sagittarius as well um and also the number what the number and so we'll see that yeah we also we talked about seven too of finding it also finds itself in the realm of mutable cardinal right um showing yourself uh, and bringing that to others in any way, shape, and form, right? Um, getting sucked up in multiple situations and seeing really what you have to offer more broadly, right? Versus, like, the fixity, which would be, like, having a sort of thing, you know? Uh, it's more stable. Um, whereas in the mutability realm, seven has to give it to multiple different people, so it has to be more of, like, a, a broader sort of trade, maybe, yeah? Um, so the air actually helps with that, because air is more communicable than actually, like... Um, realized so anyway when it's also in the realm of sagittarius which is way similarly the realm of fire and mutability but it's a little bit different it's mutable in water and it is really just um a surfing or a getting caught up and um having to be of um the currents we find ourselves in so hey it's about sums it up um yeah, yeah, so very much trying to be of other structures, but take an active, expressive role. Um, yeah. Hey, bubbling, citra, beach, out.